Welcome to the National Council on Weights and Measures, or NCWM. This organization considers proposals to amend the United States standards for weights and measures in commerce. If adopted by NCWM, NIST will publish the new standards in handbooks 44, 130, and 133 for voluntary adoption by the states. Our membership includes state, county, and city regulators, weighing and measuring device manufacturers, manufacturers of consumer goods, retailers, NIST Office of Weights and Measures staff, and other federal and foreign government officials. NCWM holds an interim meeting in January and an annual meeting in July. Locations vary, with the interim being held in a warmer destination and the July rotating between the four regional associations, Northeast, Southern, Central, and Western. On Sunday, various subcommittees or task groups meet to develop or refine proposals on the standing committee agendas. Any member can be a part of these groups, some of which are permanent, while others may be focused on a specific task, then dissolved. The evening ends with the chairman's reception. It's a great opportunity to meet the chairman and network with other attendees. Monday begins the open hearings, which continue into Tuesday morning. There are four committees that will take comments and consider any written submissions for the items on their agenda. Specifications and Tolerances present proposals to amend NIST Handbook 44. Laws and Regulations presents proposals to amend NIST Handbook 130 and 133. The Professional Development Committee focuses on training and safety and the National Type Evaluation Program Committee considers technical policies, evaluation checklists, and test procedures used with device manufacturers. And finally, the Board of Directors presents business items of the corporation. Once open hearings are complete, each committee begins their work sessions. They consider any comments made on each item and can make changes to the language previously presented. Anyone may attend a work session, but no comments are accepted. You may only observe. Ultimately, the committee will designate each item on their agenda as voting, informational, developing by the original submitter, assigned to a subcommittee or task group, or withdrawn. On Wednesday morning of the interim meeting, the chairs of each committee will announce the status of each agenda item. Their final reports will appear in NCWM Publication 16, serving as the agendas for the NCWM annual meeting in July. The annual meeting is much like the interim meeting schedule, with subcommittee meetings, open hearings, and committee work sessions. However, there are some additional functions at the annual meeting, which extends that meeting into Thursday. For example, there will be a general session on Tuesday morning, often with a welcome from a secretary or commissioner from the host state, remarks from the director of NIST, who serves as our honorary president, NCWM chairman of the board, and other dignitaries. This is followed by awards to outgoing committee members and others that served roles essential to the business of the conference in the past year. There are also presentations of special awards including Outstanding Contributions, Distinguished Service, Lifetime Achievement, and National Inspector of the Year. The day wraps up with committee work sessions, finalizing suggested changes to the proposals in Publication 16 through their addendum sheets. The addendum sheets contain changes to the agenda items and are made available Tuesday evening at the registration area. For those not attending the committee work sessions, there may be special presentations in the main ballroom. Previous presentations included emerging technologies such as transportation network systems and electric vehicle charging systems, various fuels and lubricant topics, and unit pricing. Wednesday morning, the four regional groups meet to review the addendum items and decide if they want to take a position as a region on any of them. They can also use this time to conduct regional association business meetings. These regional meetings are open to all NCWM attendees. The culmination of all these efforts by so many is the voting session on Wednesday afternoon of the annual meeting. Each standing committee will present their voting items. NCWM has a two-house voting system for amending national standards. The House of State Representatives is one vote per state. The House of Delegates consists of all other state, county, and local Weights and Measures officials. No matter the outcomes, Wednesday evening is spent in fellowship and celebration at an all-inclusive special event. In the past, this has included lake cruises, a lobster bake, museums, professional baseball, and games, dancing, and horseback riding on a ranch. In any case, it's a reminder that through all of the serious work and long hours of debates, we are friends who share a common mission to create quality standards for commerce in the United States. Thursday morning begins with the voting session for the NTEP Committee and Board of Directors reports and election of new officers. These are business items subject to a vote of all members in attendance. Then, it is the closing ceremony with the passing of the gavel to the incoming chairman, 
who will make some remarks and announce appointment to the various committees. And that's how we do it at NCWM. We look forward to seeing you there.